Well, hello. It is night time now. It is Sunday night, and I finally have my dining reservation for Space 220 tonight. I can't even wait. I've been looking forward to this for a couple years now, it seems, but I'm, it's finally my turn. And it is race weekend, so it's super busy, really busy tonight. And uh, the racers have a special party for them tonight. So they're going to kick us out at 9, but that's okay. I'm going to go back. <laughs> I have no problem going back to the hotel. So I'm going to check in hopefully very shortly for Space 220. And I'm just so happy to be here. I cannot wait to see if it's everything that I hope it to be. And I'll bring you with me and show you my experience and see if we can think about it together. So here we go. Space 220, the restaurant, is right in front of, or right beside it, of Mission Space, which is right in front of me right here. And it looks like it's right over there on the right-hand side. I just took a picture of this right here. Look at how wonderfully the moon is lined up right at the top of that spire. Isn't that cool? Ooh, I love it. So I'm all checked in and I'm able to go in. Because I'm ready. How cool. Space 220. All right. Guess we're waiting for a shuttle. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much. Boarding pass. Thank you. So, walked in right over there. This is what it looks like. We're waiting for our space shuttle to elevate our dining. Uh oh, looks like something's happening. All right, we're ready. We have our ticket. Let's go on in. Right now, we are on Earth. And we're going up. Hello. So we have up and down. In just a few moments, you'll be on your way up to Space 220 aboard the Centauri Space Station. Enjoy the ride. All right, Space Travelers, going to be traveling at 10,000 miles an hour, 220 miles above Earth. So I might want to hang on to these silver handrails in the center. And I do mean it because you do get a little fast in here. I don't have that problem because I have space suit. Oh, oh, oh. Initiating in three, two, one. Lift off. You're riding aboard the Mark V Stellivator, the latest in space elevator engineering. Looks like we lucked out tonight. The atmosphere is clear, and we have a spectacular view of the eastern seaboard. Enjoy your journey. We'll be back in a bit.
give you some views of space lettuce. Oh, oh it's just kind of creepy. Everything's just a little creepy. Hope there's no aliens up here. Hope I get a good seat. I don't know, but that is just a really cool view, isn't it? Without anybody here. Thank you. Thank you very much. 220 miles directly above that pot. Now this is one of my favorite rooms here. It always gets overlooked for how simple it is. But if you look closely, it's our beautiful wine cellar. Oh, it is. One of these are real bottles of wine, and the different variants are all featured on our wine list. Very nice. We hold over 270 bottles in this room, and in case of an emergency, I'll break the glass. I love it. Hopefully, well, I don't know. I don't want to say that I hope there's an emergency. Depends on what it is, right? Okay. Wow. We're getting taken over here. That's a good speed spot. A sweet spot. There you go. Perfect. Oh, look at he's doing his thing. All right. This is the view from my seat. So I've got a really great view, I think. I'm very happy with it. Table for two. Very nice. Filling up one seat, but my bag has another, and I see a shuttle that's probably gonna go over to this one in a moment, maybe. Maybe not. I think it just went above us, so I'm, I was told I need to keep a good eye out because things happen all the time here. Yeah, it's beautiful. The write-up was quite neat, I'll tell you. I see a space van over there. Just a, a quick view about the whole restaurant. Here's the QR code if you want to take a look at the menu up close. Hopefully that will work for you. What I think I'm going to have is the Centauri Caesar salad and I'm going to have the one and a half pound baked whole lobster stuffed with jumbo crab and then for dessert either a chocolate cheesecake or sorbet. Probably strawberry sorbet, lemon sorbet. That's where I'm looking for. Yeah, I think that sounds pretty lovely. Definitely. I think that's what I'm gonna have in space. I mean, I'm in space, I might as well, right? So this is my Caesar salad. It looks really nice. Lots of Parmesan cheese, the way I like it. And I got some duck horn wine. So, looks very nice. Very close. I'm going to enjoy this. Yum. Caesar salad is delightful in space. It's very good. Instead of traditional croutons, it's like they've crumbled up the croutons and just went doo -doo 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 all over. But it's lovely. Just a mini uh, Caesar salad. You can't go wrong with that, so. Very happy with it. How is your Caesar so far now? It's very well, thank you. This is actually probably one of my favorite Caesar salads I've ever had. Because it's mini leaves, they're sweet almost. But the garlic dressing is amazing. It is, you have that hint of the anchovy, but there's so much lovely garlic in it. Oh, it is delicious and the Parmesan they were not skimpy on the Parmesan. If you like Caesar salads, and it's also, it's not drowned in dressing, which I've had before. It's just, 
It's lovely. I think I really needed another salad today. So I'm glad that I have this. So, mmm, yummy. Yep, that was the best Caesar salad that I've had in like the last 20 years. It was perfect. I loved everything about it. I loved the presentation of it, where, where it had just a small things of leaves, the crumble on it, and tons of Parmesan, the garlicky, fishy dressing. It was amazing. I, it was so crunchy. Wow, if you like, if you honestly like Caesar salads, that's what you should get here. I've heard that the cauliflower is wonderful, but boy, that Caesar salad was incredible. Mmm, wonderful. Losing my adjectives. Ah. <laughs> wow, <laughs> thank you. Look what I have. That is butter on a very, very hot plate. So, I've got lobster that's stuffed with jumbo crab, soaking in butter. Oh, gorgeous. Ooh. I wish you could smell a vision because it is amazing. Yum. Jumbo crab is in a Newburgh sauce. It's like a creamy, creamy sauce. And on top of my lobster, I have these big chunks of lobster. Ho, ho, ho. Gonna enjoy this. It's super, super hot. But oh, melt in your mouth, I tell ya. Look at this piece of lobster. Where we get it? Oh, that looks pretty good. Right here. It's thinking. It's not going to show you, but I can see it. It's buttery and very lemony. Beautiful. Comes with broccolini as well. So, there's my healthy part. Haha, <laughs> wink wink. Yep, I'm going to enjoy this meal very much. I'm so happy to be in space. My lobster and crab dish is gorgeous. And the broccolini is nice and crisp and just perfect. I am so happy with this entree. I'm so happy with what I'm experiencing right now. If I keep looking outside or through the window area, it's because things keep going by. I see space shuttles and astronauts and lightsabers and it's just, Pretty funny, actually. I know David's gonna love it here. <laughs> yeah, food food is great. Food is worth every bit if you're willing to get here and spend some time. Take your time when you eat. Don't be rushed. And just enjoy the atmosphere. Enjoy what's going on around you. Food is fabulous so far. So I've had the Caesar salad and now the lobster stuffed with king crab. Super delicious. So I love anything that puts me in a different space. Ha, <laughs> that was funny. I love anything that puts me in a different place, like space. Thank you. I'm gonna have to figure out what I want for dessert. I think I'm gonna have lemon sorbet, that would perfect absolutely perfect kind of a, as a palate cleanser because this was really 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 rich you think there's not a lot of food but it's drenched in butter <laughs> but yeah it's, it's gorgeous I'm I'm so happy with this I'm glad that I had my finger on the trigger at 11 o'clock UK time 60 days out I'm glad I got these reservations. I think you will too, if you enjoy something unique. 
like this, Space 220 is it. That was not the first time that I had to growl at the waiter to keep away from my food I'm still working. Yeah, get very possessive of my meals when they're really delicious. And I like to take my time when I eat, so it's not the usual in, out, I'm gone. So yeah, I go, I'm enjoying my meal. I have a lobster tail here. I love the lobster tail. Do you like lobster? Tell me about it in the comments below, because I certainly do. I did have a lobster in Mexico that was about 15 times the size of this. I swear it was like that thick and like from here to here. Huge on the beaches in Mexico. But you know what, I'm in space. I guess things are a little smaller in space, but ooh, he's dripping butter. I better eat him. Wow, what an impressive entree. I am so pleased that I got a chance to experience it. So now I have the dessert menu and the supernova sweets. We have carrot cake, a peanut caramel comet, a chocolate cheesecake, gelato and sorbet. We've got a choice of vanilla, chocolate, strawberry, or lemon and a pistachio and citrus little cake. There's also dessert drinks, an espresso martini, the Milky Way, which is chilled espresso, spiced brown sugar syrup, caramel, cream, and Milky Way. Coffee espresso, double espresso, cappuccino and latte, all that would keep me up all night long. So I'm gonna have some lemon sorbet just to freshen up the palate once again, but oh my gosh, all in all, an amazing meal so far. I am so excited to be here. I really, really am. Great time. And my last course is lemon sorbet. Can't go wrong with lemon sorbet if it's nice and tart. Gorgeous. I'm going to enjoy this now up in space. So the lemon sorbet is gorgeous. It is so tart, completely cleansing my palate, and it's crumbly, which is lovely. Huh. Perfect end to a perfect meal. Great place, space 220. I've said that like 15 times already, but I really do mean it. I've really enjoyed my evening here. I'm glad that I made the reservations. I'm glad I came, glad I ate. Yeah, perfect evening here. I cannot wait to come back and enjoy this experience again. So thank you very much. I'll t when I leave to go back on the shuttle down to earth, I'll take you there as well. So I'll see you then. Here we go. That was a good decision not to take the wine to go. It was fabulous. It was out of this world and I almost said that as well. I did. Thank you. Thank you.
Here we go. Watch your stuff as you enter this elevator. We will be on our way shortly. All right, space travelers, going to be traveling at 14,000 miles an hour, so we're going 4,000 faster than we are, coming up, so we're going to hang on to those handrails as tight as possible. Thank you. It was wonderful. We made it back home. Hooray. Phew. Very nice. I take a picture in here. All right. I'm going to do one more pan. And I'm out. What a great meal. I am so impressed. Ugh, yeah, I'll be shouting it from the rooftops. What a great meal that was. What a neat experience too. I will definitely be wanting to come back. Great meal. Thank you, Space 220. It was fabulous. We were up there. See you tomorrow.